<coughs> what is up, YouTube? How's everybody doing? Hopefully, you guys are doing fantastic. So, we're about to bring you a video. Sorry about the quality right now. I wanted to bring you a video this late at night. Well, at least in the darkness, because number one, it's pretty much um, a number one safety tip for your vehicle. Let's just say, put it like that. So, when you're driving, and you know you got your hands full and you can't be touching your cell phone or you're gonna get a three five hundred dollar ticket you know what i mean so a lot of our cars are now coming with either apple play or um, android auto or if you have like a cigarette lighter adapter that can plug into your cigarette lighter you have the ability to use bluetooth capabilities on your phone now the question is does all this sh stuff actually work right now i'm sitting in a 2018 toyota rav4 xle um, this car has a lot of good features to it. It's a beautiful, beautiful car. I actually love this car. It's very nice, good on gas. I mean, I can't say too much bad things about it. But in this car, they have um, Bluetooth capabilities that you can hook your, your, your phone to your uh, radio. Now, just like Dodge, the, Dodge has their Uconnect. Um, I'm not sure where Ford has or any of the other cars. Um, I know, I don't know what this one's called in here, but... We'll get the lady talk. What would you like to do? See, there she is. I'll turn her off. Oh, sorry. Cancel her. Whatever. Anyway, we'll, we'll just let her talk. But basically, so what this does is you press that button twice. You say, hey, turn to this channel. I missed that. Anyway, it'll say, hey, turn to this channel. Hey, turn to that channel. Hey, can you do this? Can you do that? Can you tell me what the traffic is? Blah, blah, blah. And this particular radio will tell you that information if it's available. Um, now, being that, I'm you know, sorry. obviously... I still didn't get that. To use this speech recognition system... There. Canceled. <laughs> so, anyway, being that every system would have their flaws. Chevy, Ford, Dodge, you know, maybe the higher, uh, at higher end cars as well. The problem with this is, guys, is that, you know, coming along from where it started to where it is now and i'm not sure how it is on the newer vehicles like you know 2023s and so forth um this system needs to be 100 percent because you know obviously we can't be fooling around with our cell phones or if you're crazy enough to do that you can either get into an accident get a nasty fine get points in your license but the main thing is getting into an accident either harming yourself or somebody else i would not want that to happen to you nor would anybody else the problem with this is, guys, is that, you know, there's plenty of devices out there that could help you. Um, again, you, if you have any type of uh, text-to-speech on your phone, like Apple has, Siri, um, Android has, uh, uh, whatever, Google, whatever. And obviously, they have their flaws as well. But I use Siri a lot. Siri normally gets it right 90% of the time. The other 10%, she actually should not know who the hell I am. Um... The same thing with the car lights. For example, let me turn her on. What would you like to do? Tune to channel 88. Wow. Tuning to channel 88. She actually heard me that time. I'm not going to play it, though, because I don't want to get copyrighted. But there's times where the system, I'll say the same exact thing at least 10 times to where she's like, what is that? What is that? You know, just like my wife. But anyway, um... <laughs> These these systems are put in place, guys, for our safety, you know. And I I get it. There's gonna be their flaws, you know. And not not all of them are gonna be 100. percent But we need to get you know make sure going forward that these systems are there for us when we need them, like now. And it's right now it's 7:34 at night, and it looks like it's about 12 o'clock at night outside. If I turned off this camera, you wouldn't be able to see me. Well, you probably would, but. Basically, what I'm saying is, is that these safety features and safety tips that we have in these vehicles nowadays, they need to be on point and on par. Because if not, I mean, there's going to be young kids driving these cars, 18, 17, 16, and you think they're going to want to put their, their phone down? Hell no, they don't. They want to hold their phone, talk to their friends in the ears, whatever. And a lot of them don't carry Bluetooth devices in their pockets, and most of them don't even know how to attach the phone. Oh, no, I lied. This is a new gen, new era, so these kids know how to, you know, obviously hook this, this stuff up. But just saying, guys, it's a little rant on the channel tonight. But 
in part two, I'm actually going to go to a Toyota dealership. I don't know if it's going to be tomorrow or the day after. Um, but I am going to go in and I'm going to look at a uh, 2023 Toyota RAV4. And I'm going to try to do, use the same feature. Uh, if, they, if it's already been PDI'd. And if it's so, I'm going to go use the same feature and see actually how, how it is and shoot a video in the car. Um, as if they allow me. If not, I'll find one. But um, thanks for watching, guys. We are still waiting for our sponsor to come through. This is a good sponsor, very good sponsor I'm waiting for. Um, they got in, in touch with me on TikTok, and I'm very thankful for that. And we're waiting for them to come through. And once they do, guys, they're going to showcase their products in this car first. And then we got a older Toyota, uh, it was a Corolla or a Camry. It's about a 98 or so, 98 to 2002, somewhere in there. But the car is nice. Does need an interior job, so we got that car. We got a Honda, um, and two other cars we got to do. And I'm basically holding those cars to the side for right now because these are the products are gonna, you know, what's gonna set this channel going forward. And not only that, make these cars look a lot fresher. And basically, we're just gonna move the channel forward. We're gonna keep going up. We're gonna use these cars to elevate us into the next level.